What's up guys? Welcome to Carlton's Travel Adventures. I'm here with a paisa. I wanted to ask some questions about race, okay? Okay. Uh, hola. Hola. Ah, bueno. Uh, ¿Cuál es su nombre? Paola. Paola. Gracias, Paola. Um, uh, ¿Dónde vive? Medellín. Medellín. ¿Te gusta sí. Medellín? Sí. ¿Toda la vida en Medellín? Sí. Ah, bueno, bueno. Okay. Yo tengo una pregunta para ti. Sí. Okay. ¿Cuál es tu raza? Trigueña. Trigueña. Sí. Mm, trigueña. Eh, pregunta, ¿es trigueña un raza o un color? Color. Pues no ten, no ten raza. No es raza, es color. Es trigueña. color. Trigueña sí. es color. Okay, sí. okay. ¿Qué, qué, yo, yo trigueña también. No. No trigueña. No es trigueña. No. ¿Qué, qué es? Eh, moreno. Yo es moreno. Negro, sí. Oh, yes, negro and moreno. Sí. En tu, en tu trigueña. Sí. Tu raza es trigueña. Sí, no, mi color es trigueño. Tu color. Sí. So, Payola, ¿cuál es tu raza? Aquí la raza no es tan importante. Lo que importa aquí, pues se fija más es en el color. Si es negro, si es trigueño o si es blanco. Ah, so, para uh, colombiana, raza no es importante. No, no es importante. Oh, más bien como el color. Color, es okay. negro. O sea, Tú eres moreno, yo soy trigueña, tú eres blanco. Ah, es lo okay. que importa. Ok, ok, bueno, bueno, gracias para tu tiempo. Bueno, a okay. ti. Bye, say bye. Bye. <laughs> Welcome to Carlton's Travel Adventures. Another beautiful day in Medellin. <sighs> Folks, uh, one topic that always caught my interest was the topic about race. You know, um, not a good way, a bad way, it just in generality, um, I realized that over time from being here in Medellin, people don't really focus on race that much. It's a big deal in the U.S. Um, because of the history, slavery and so forth. But here, it's not a big, big deal. And I, I've been going to therapy, I broke, not broke, I kind of sprained my hand here uh, a couple weeks ago. Well, probably a month ago, it's had not getting better. Ligament here, I guess, is pulled, and I can't open a bottle even that great. And it's what's hurting me and really out of pain. I use my left hand. So I'm sitting in therapy. Uh, this week, I went five days a week this week. At one o'clock, five days a week. Industrialis Sora. And I'm sitting near a table with four people around it. Usually, everybody have a lot of problem with their hand. That's a very common thing with the hand, I was told. Because I mean, I've seen people here all the time, just like me, with the, either the wrist, or the carpal tunnel, or like I have right here, you can't open a bottle. So, it's a good opportunity for me to sit down and talk to people when we're around the table. And believe me, when you speak English, you catch a lot of attention, you know, by looking at you, especially when a lady's trying to talk to me, the therapist trying to talk to me, different ones, and since I come there every day, it's, uh, you know, kind of like, I'm, 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 I catch your interest, because I, I, I don't speak uh, Spanish that well. Well enough to understand, but not well. So I usually see people around the table um, and I try to talk to them. Especially, I've always got to find a one or two people that knows a little English and I want to practice. It's like I want to practice my Spanish, you know. So yesterday I saw two ladies, one very attractive lady, younger, probably in the mid, low 30s. Another lady that's older, probably in her 50s. Nice lady. But you know, they didn't have that white look. There's kind of a clear skin, but not that white. Uh, Anglo look, this kind of mix look. So we, t we talked the entire half an hour. My therapy is about an hour. Talk about half an hour, all kind of things, you know. Want to know where I'm from and all this stuff about America. And I'm, I'm practicing my Spanish, I always do that, you know. And then I looked at her and I said, look at both of them. I looked a little different. They're both light skinned. Look. And I said, let me ask this question. So I asked her, you know, what ra the lady in front of me, the older lady, what race are you? And it caught, caught a lot of attention because the lady, other lady, younger, younger girl, right beside me, I didn't know she speak English too, and she understood. So I asked, lady, what race are you? I asked her, what race? I want to see if she says she's white, uh, or what, if she, what are you, you know? And she says, um, tra Tracania. I always mess that up. Tra Tragenio. She said, I said, I'm Tragenio. And I'm saying, wait a minute now. She's Tragenio. So I said, okay, note that. Asked a lady next to me, I said, she, she said, she's, she said she's Tragenia, she's, she's not white. 
And I said, oh, you speak English? She said, yeah, I speak English, a lot of good English. She said, okay, well, well, you look different than her, a little different, you look a little whiter. I said, what race are you? She said, I'm Tragania also. I'm saying, is this not a race? You know, Tragania is not a race, you know? So I kept talking to him, I said, well, Tragania is a race. I said, no, it's a color. And so I asked the lady in front of me, I said, the older lady, I said, look, well, look at my color. You know, I'm a little darker than you are. What, what if you were my color? Everything else is okay, same thing on you, but what if you were my color? I said, what would you be? She said, I'd be dark Tragania. <laughs> I <I'm> said, <laughs> I cracked up. I said, I'm not laughing at you. <laughs> I thought it was funny. He said, you're dark Tragania. So after that, now we had to leave therapy. And I said, that's interesting. So I was supposed to go to uh, Poblado, look for a camera, that uh, Osmo pocket camera thing for my YouTube. And somebody told me it was over there in one of those camera shops in Santa Fe Mall. So I hooked up with my boy Domain. We headed over there, told him to meet me, you know, head over there. And I said, let me ask people in the mall the same questions, you know. And I asked most, so mostly women, almost all women actually, <laughs> generating conversation. So I asked the people this question, what are you? And amazingly, almost all of them, like eight out of 10 said they're Tregani. I'm saying, that's not a race. Tregani is not a race. <laughs> and what race are you? <laughs> Raza, race are you? They understand the question, but they don't understand what race they are, you know? So that night, I came home last night, spoke to my friend Alexander, she speaks English, and another friend I know, you know, and I asked the same question. And one said, Caucasian originally, but just said, I'm not sure. See, I might be Caucasian, but I'm not sure. She looks white. Um, it's Alexander's darker skin like me. So I said, I just said, I said, you white? She said, she said, I don't know, really, I don't know what I am. I guess I'm, you know, indigenous with, with white. I said, you're mestizo. You said, yeah, I'm mestizo. But it's kind of caught my interest that she didn't know what she was, you know? And so I asked, uh, saw, saw my, the beginning of the tape, I asked a young lady I know this morning about the same question, you know? She's like, you saw a picture there. I said, well, what race are you? She said, I'm Tragania. I said, well, you're not a, that's not a race. That's not a race. So I sat down, I spoke to her really in a long discussion. I said, do me a favor. I'm going to ask you the question on video, you know, answer it for me, you know, so people can see what I mean. So I said, it's not made up. I said, what, what race are you? I said, I'm Tregania. I said, what race am I? I just said, you're, you said you're black. This is, that's not a race. You said, just no, you explain, it's, it's, just, it's a skin color. We, we do it by skin color, either Tregania either black or you're white. And if I pronounce Tregania wrong, just don't get on my case, right? Just, just correct me. I think it's Tregania. But I said, well, it was, he said, no, you're, we do it by color. You know, either Tregania, either black or you're white. Three of us, three, three options rather. And I said, what if you're indigenous, like the white, Wahoo, W-A-Y-U-U. I'm gonna see them actually my next trip. Um, he just said, well, they're indigenous. Well, but why are they indigenous and you are a color? They said, well, they're different. I said, okay, oh, this is confusing. <laughs> so, if you're Colombian especially, you know, I know Americans gonna butt in. You know, I, I'm not preventing conversation from Americans, but it, it means more if you're Colombian or South American, you know, and you can explain to me, you know, some more in-depth discussion about this race thing, you know. And they don't understand what race is, you know, or it's not important. And, my, and a girl this morning explained to me, it's not important. We don't discuss race, at least she doesn't. We don't discuss race. We do more discuss the color, not the race, you know. So, okay, all right. That's what it is, because uh, eight out of ten people I asked in San Santa Fe Mall, and, you know, and uh, the, the therapy uh, session, they say Tregania. I think two said Caucasian or white, okay? But most of them said they're Tregania. 
I guess you're associating Tregena with mestiz Mestizo, okay? This is an interesting topic for me, you know? Um, and I just thought, thought that maybe I can throw it out you got from the discussion, you know, and see what you guys think about it. And, you know, if you Colombians uh, have some input about this, let me know. But I want to know the majority you think about the race issue. You consider yourself Mestizo, you consider yourself Tregenia, what is the what are the, the difference in the uh, in the percentage? I'm just curious about that. All right. Anyway, thanks for watching. Interesting topic. I'm I think I'm all set now. Where I want to go? Don't be surprised. Going to be a long trip. And thanks for watching. And don't forget to like my videos. Okay. Appreciate you. Thank you.